So on the ferry to Hidden Boat Island right now, I'm here with Steve, Heather, and Selena. And we're gonna meet a whole bunch of awesome divers over there. And we're gonna be doing a big cleanup of the marina around the ferry terminals. And thanks to BC Ferries, they paid for our travel expenses to go across. And it's gonna be awesome to do this. So we should get a huge pile of trash. And I'm pretty excited to show you guys what we find. This is going to be a bit of a longer video and show a bit more of the reality of our cleanup dives. Even though I feel like I like to talk, I would just be rambling if I tried to talk for the entire length of this video. So I'm just going to add a bit here and then throw some music in the background and you can watch firsthand just how some of our trash cleanups go. Often when we do a dive like this, I get hours of footage and I trim it down to about 5 minutes and just show the cool stuff I bring up, like phones and whatnot. But no one really wants to ever watch me picking up trash for hours, so I did trim this down a little bit, so it's only going to be around 20 minutes. And you'll be able to see here just how much trash there actually is. In total, we pulled out 1,104 pounds of trash, and after the cleanup, I went for a swim to see the difference we made, and we only put a dent in it. I definitely plan to return here and make a bigger dent and spend a bit more time, I could easily see us pulling out thousands of pounds of more trash. So that's definitely a plan for the future. Anyways, thanks to all the divers who attended this, and thank you for the municipality for providing a truck and hauling away all our trash, and thanks to BC Ferries for the ride over to the island. Alright guys, grab a drink and sit back and watch me swim around picking up things. <laughs> thanks for watching guys. When you put your hand in my jacket, I'm thinking so irrational. You flew me international now. And we could spend hours reading the signals, but that's so unoriginal. What if we took this back to my house? Under all these lights, I gotta take a minute, take a minute, take a minute to calm down. But I feel like if I told you I was ready right this minute, do you think that it would turn you on? Should I go and call up a taxi? We can make out for a play in the backseat. Please tell me now how that all sounds. You can sleep in while I make breakfast, watch cartoons and talk about exits. And if you have me stick around, I just feel like this is worth the risk. I never felt a quiet like this. If I told you I was ready right this minute, do you think that it would turn you around? If I told you I was ready right this minute, would you just run off and tell someone? I just feel like you need to be right now. We're running out of things to talk about. Right here, right now. I'm about to let the truth come out. If I told you I was ready right this minute.
chances to take my time to keep on dancing to walk that line yeah got me shifting the paradigm the longer wishing wishing don't mind
It's a nice little stool. <laughs> Somewhere in there, but I'm gonna try and pull something up right now. I don't know if I can get it up though. It might be too heavy. Oh no, we got it. Save the starfish. Don't don't stab the starfish. Wait, wait, sir. Looks a little seized. Carb cleaner, she's good. <laughs> <laughs> We had a pretty good cleanup. Big thing of trash. Big thanks to all the divers that came out. It was uh, over a thousand pounds. It's pretty good. And I got two cell phones. So that's always fun. <laughs> I guess. Thanks for watching. Take care. <laughs>